Hello viewers, welcome to this channel. If this is your first time on this channel, please kindly subscribe, share and like this page. Thank you so much. The news is that Gumi Sheikh has revealed solution to end crimes among its men. The popular Islamic scholar Sheikh Gumi has revealed that the best way to get rid of crime among its men is through building schools for its men and their children to rehabilitate them and prevent them from taking to banditry as a way of life. Gumi disclosed that in February this year, he was in Janjala Forest of Kangako to meet with eight men to encourage them to resist and fight back against the bad eggs among them, adding that the foundation stone of a school was also done that very day. According to Gumi, about 600 students were enrolled, out of which 150 are married women. He started further that the 600 students who were enrolled in the school have now tested the sweetness of knowledge and have also seen the value of education. He said because of this, they cannot be recruited anymore to commit crimes as they now have eye on a brighter future, adding that this is how a society is transformed and redirected. They have now tested the sweetness of knowledge and have seen the value of education. They cannot be recruited anymore to commit crimes as they are now looking forward to a brighter future of respect and dignity. Imagine if we have these kinds of center all over the forest in different states. In no time, the bad eggs will have no justification for committing crimes. This is a practical example for people to emulate and governments to listen to. May Allah continue to guide us and bring peace and tranquility to our nation. I say army to this, the scholar, I, I say army to the prayer of Gumi, Sheikh Gumi, but I don't want to agree with you, with your opinion at all, sir. I believe it is not so easy, like you just said, to rehabilitate criminals. No, it is not. Not just like that. Not when the kidnapping business has now become a lucrative business in Nigeria. Which kind of work can an educated person do that we earn in millions of naira? Millions of naira for that matter. Yeah. Even our children, even those people that are in town, not even in the forest, that have gone to school, which work has this government provided for them that they are doing? that can hand them millions of naira that arts men are collecting when they abduct people. What are we talking about? Gumi should go and sit down and rethink what he's saying. Oh, I think this is another way. He's coming up with another way of collecting money or asking government to bring money so that they can build schools in forest, Abi. When we have not finished developing the, 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 the city, the towns, we have not finished develop, no development. Now you want to carry money and go and build school in the forest for people you don't, you, you, you are calling them that they, 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 you want to rehabilitate them. What kind of rehabilitation is that? What kind of rehabilitation? People that have tested millions of naira by kidnapping people. They have seen kidnapping as a major business. What education will rehabilitate criminals like that? I don't understand the kind of country we are. And I don't talk, understand the way people reason. I think Gumi should just go and sit down somewhere and stop disturbing us. Because just as um, Kayode, Fanifaya Kayode have said, you are lovers of, of banditry, I mean, ba ba banditry and, and kidnappers. Go and sit down. But please, let's listen to some comments of good Nigerians here. Somebody said, Bola Alebioshu. He says, no, I totally disagree with Gumi. The so-called earthmen and bandits that have killed and rendered so many family homeless, so not, so not to be spared at all. No, they don't have to be spared. Talk less of now building schools in the forest. Can you just imagine building schools in the forest? For what? Another person said, Bola Bakari, he says, the only way to rehabilitate earthmen is to create ranches. Thank you very much, my brother. Go and create ranches, not schools. This one does not value school. Even if they go to school, it cannot, in fact, it can't be like the lucrative business they do. 
go and create ranch for them. Eh? Mr. Gumi, Sheyi, go and create ranch for them. We do not agree with this. But this is my own thinking. This is my own opinion. And we have listened to the opinions of two Nigerians here. But my viewers, what is your own take on this? Do you agree with Gumi that yes, schools should be built in the forest for the earth's men? Or you disagree with him? Whatever your opinion, please kindly drop your comments in the comment section. And don't forget, please kindly subscribe, share and like this video. Thank you. God bless you.